Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and in today's video um, I'm gonna show you a quick and easy makeup look. Um, this is a look that I normally do when I am on the run. I'm just going to run some errands or take care of some things. Um, nothing too drastic though. Um, but if you want to find out how to get this look, um, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share my channel, and just keep watching so you can see how I get this look. So first I'm going to um, start off, um, I already moisturized my face and everything. I'm going to take the Dr. Brandt Pores No More um, Luminizer Primer. I have been noticing that this has really made a difference um, in my skincare. And I just pretty much like take it in my T-zone. And then I'm going to take the e.l.f. Prep and Hydrate Balm. And I'm going to rub that all over the face as well. I'm going to spray my face with some primer water by Smashbox. And um, for this look, I'm not going to be applying n n um, no foundation. I am just going to be applying concealer. And the two concealers that I'm going to take is the ColourPop No Filter and my Milani Retouch and Erase. And this, I guess I'll zoom you guys in for this part. And all I pretty much do is just take concealer where I have redness on my face. So pretty much my cheeks. I take some underneath my eyes as well and I kind of mix it with the Milani one and then I just take like where I have blemishes or anything like that and then I just take my beauty blender and pretty much just um blend it all together for the days like where I just have to run errands or go to doctor's appointments this is what I do I think it's a good um, look because I don't like want to have too much makeup and this like really takes me like um, maybe like 10-15 minutes the most to do. It really doesn't like take me long at all to achieve this look. And before I set my face, I'm going to take the Hula um, Quickie Contour Stick by Benefit. And I'm just going to contour my face. And I'm only taking this where I want it. And then I just use my Beauty Blender to help blend it in. This is probably like the only time I use cream products. It's when I'm just doing a really simple, well to me this is a simple look, but to everyone else it's probably not. And I really like this contour stick because it's really like super easy to blend out. The next thing I'm going to do is take this Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops in Moonlight. Um, it's just a little sample size that I got a long time ago. And I'm just going to place some. Um, 
and I'm just gonna work with this with my fingers because every time I try to use a beauty blender it doesn't seem to come out right then now I'm gonna go in with my beauty blender and try to blend it out and then I'm just gonna go and do the other thing on the other side kind of gives you that glow from within and I'm just gonna take whatever highlight I have left and kind of dab it on my forehead to make my forehead appear glowy I'm gonna use this equal tools precision foundation brush I've like really been enjoying this brush lately and I'm just going to kind of press that underneath the eyes and the lids Um, I'm just gonna take my Dream Street palette by Kathleen Knights and I'm just gonna take whatever colors honestly um, I'm just gonna take this color just the first color just to get some um, some type of shadow in my eye I'm gonna take um, this shade right here for my brow bone. I'm gonna take my multitasking powder brush and kind of help set that contour and the rest of my face pretty much except the highlight. And then I'm gonna take um, my ColourPop liner in Mr. Bean and I'm gonna line my waterline with I'm gonna take this is actually a new mascara I picked up it is um, by the brand Koki professional um, volume and length mascara I actually found it at Meyer. who would have known right I like this mascara because it really gives me some lashes. So once I am done with that, but yeah, I'm gonna take this Hard Candy Glow All The Way Highlighter, I mean highlighter, bronzer in 130 Tropics. And I'm just gonna take my Equal Tools brush my equal tools highlighting brush or actually i'm gonna mix my two blushes by um burt's bee toasted cinnamon and the bare peach one i really love mixing these together and the combination that it gives my skin and then um last but not least is i'm just gonna take a little little bit of the Jeffree Star Skin Frost Highlight in um, the collab with Manny in Eclipse. And I'm just going to take a little bit. Just to kind of set that highlight that I put down. Just because I kind of don't want it to go anywhere. I'm just going to spray my brush so I can put it in the inner corner. I'm going to take the lipstick um, from Kat Von D and Lolita. It's the one that comes in this. Such a beautiful shade of lipstick. This pretty much like completes the look. I'm just going to spray my face with the Too, Fa Too Faced Hangover 3-in-1. And the Wet n Wild Matte Finish Setting Spray. And that pretty much completes this look. This is pretty much just a quick um, makeup look for when I need to run errands and hurry up and get out the door. 
Um, sometimes I don't even apply all of this. Um, I will honestly just apply. Um, I will just do my brows and some lipstick and walk out the door. Um, because I usually wear my glasses. But if I put my contacts on, this is something more wearable that I will do. Just to give, you know, a little something. But, you know, the glowing always has to be real. Because if not, please. Um, but this is just something quick and easy that I like to put together. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. I got my meal. This is just my quick makeup. Got toothpaste. I mean toothpaste, lipstick on my teeth. 